Every day when the sun rises, hundreds of thousands of PG&E customers are proving the value of solar. With the solar billing plan, solar customers can expect to save up to 40% on electric charges compared to non-solar customers. Of course, how solar works is personalized to each home or business. With the solar billing plan, it has to do with how much electricity your system generates and how much you use hourly, daily, monthly, and annually. Sometimes you may produce more power than you use, and this excess energy is sent to the grid. Or there may be times when a home or business uses more power than their solar panels generate, and you need to supplement with energy from the grid. So the amount of energy your system generates and how much energy you use will determine if you end up with a charge or a credit for the month. And just like other goods and materials, the difference in available solar energy supply versus demand impacts how much that energy is valued. As a solar billing plan customer, you are credited for the value of each kilowatt hour of excess energy sent to the grid. Credits are more valuable during times of high energy demand, such as 4 p.m. to 9 p.m. and lower at other times. So sending energy to the grid from 4 to 9 p.m. earns you more credits. And the higher demand during 4 to 9 p.m. means the cost of receiving energy from the grid is higher than two. Adding battery storage can maximize the value of your solar system during times of high demand, such as 4 p.m. to 9 p.m. It offers flexibility in deciding when generated solar energy is used and when excess energy is sent to the grid for credits earned. Every month, there are charges for energy you used from the grid, which includes taxes, fees, and a fixed charge, sometimes called a base services charge. Then there's a credit for energy sent to the grid. That adds up to the total bill. Your monthly energy charges will adjust up or down depending on the season. In winter, when there's less sun for solar energy production and energy usage is higher, you may owe more. In spring, energy charges may be more moderate when solar generation increases with longer, sunnier days and your energy usage decreases. In summer, when there's the most sun for solar energy production, you may be able to offset some higher cooling costs, helping reduce your overall energy bill. And fall, like spring, tends to be more moderate. Then, every 12 months, you get a true-up statement that reconciles the remaining charges and credits you received over the past year. If you have a balance remaining, your true-up statement will include the amount that is due. If you have a credit remaining, nothing is owed. If you generated more energy than you consumed in total over the year, you're eligible for net surplus compensation. Net surplus compensation compensates you when you produce more energy than you used over the annual true-up period. This is just a quick look at what you can expect when you're a solar PG&D customer. But whatever kind of solar household or business you are, here's one more thing to know. Everyone with solar can save money on energy while they're making a difference for the environment. From all of us at PG&E, we thank you for your commitment to a future powered by clean energy.